been struggling with weight loss and want to get the body of your dreams and tried every single diet there is and nothing has worked? Well, I completely understand you because I've done the same things. My name is Alina Zhukovska and I'm a raw food chef and health coach that specializes in weight loss according to fashion. I want to make this really, really quick with three tips on how to lose weight according to fashion. Tip number one, do not listen to others. Now, there are tons of weight loss books, the same way that there are tons of books on fashion and magazines, what to wear, what not to wear, the trends of the season. Now, let's, let's just be honest with this. If legs are not your best feature, no matter how trendy short shorts are, you're not going to wear them. So why would you want to eat meat and uh, cheese, according to Atkins, if that doesn't make you feel good, if it doesn't make you look good? So stop listening to other people's opinions and do what makes you feel good. Start listening to your body because your body does not skip a beat. Your body knows how to breathe. Your body knows exactly what it needs. So listen to your body first and foremost. Tip number one. Tip number two, experiment. When you go into the um, Nordstrom or Saks or whatever store of your choice, you go in and you try different outfits, you go to fitting room and you try them on, see what makes you feel good, what makes you look good. Do the same with food. You know, try things like dulse. You know, this is a great sea vegetable. If you've never tried it, how do you know that you're not going to like it? So try things, experiment with different things. Try mames, try chlorella, try spaghetti squash, try things that you've never tried before because then you might experiment and see that you find your own food style. So that's tip number two, experiment. And lastly, tip number three is find support. Find somebody who educates you and teaches you what is out there and tells you, is dolls good for your body type? Is dolls not so good for your body type? You want support of a person who is knowledgeable and who doesn't judge you. You know, I'm a health coach. I have many clients who eat meat, who eat cheese. I don't judge them. They are who they are. My job is to teach them what is the best cheese, if that's what they want to eat, what is the best meat, how to combine it, so that in the end, you know, the outfit you're looking for, the accessories, the necklaces, whatever it is, the bracelets, you want it to work for you. The same with food. You want to accessorize your meals with the exact right condiments and nutritional support that makes you feel good, that makes you look good. That's the biggest, biggest priority. You're looking good and feeling good. And I'm sure people are thinking, well, a cheeseburger makes me feel good. Uh, not so much because after you eat a cheeseburger in about 10 minutes, in about an hour, are you really feeling that good? Is your body really feeling that good? Because I can promise you there are things that if you've never tried them, you don't even know how good your potential of feeling is. So, how good your potential to feel good is. Well, you got the gist. So anyway, my point is, make sure that you don't listen to anybody else, but listen to your body more than anything. That you experiment and that you get support. And my website is letyourselfblossom.com. There's a lot of different fun things you can read about, how food and fashion compare. Because let's face it, we all have to wear clothes and we all have to eat. So don't be a fashion victim and don't be a food victim as well. So stay fabulous, look fabulous, and let yourself blossom.